in Croatia on, on Tuesday. Over in Croatia, we've got a very good result. You played a fantastic game there. You got a lot of plaudits for that performance. What did you make of, of the game over there? Um, obviously, I think, first of all, the result. It was um, a great result for us. Um, on the back of a couple of disappointing ones before that, but um, that was, it was a great result for us. Obviously, they were, they were ranked fourth in the world at the time. Um, so we get go there and get anything, especially in the middle of the summer when boys are supposed to be on holiday, was, uh, was a great result for us. It was one of the first times yourself and Russell formed that kind of centre partnership and you've played a few times together now as well. How do you enjoy playing with him? Um, well, I think the, the, the more you play, especially at a uh, position like centre half, the more you play with somebody, the more you get used to each other and the, the relationship builds. So um, I think the more we play together, the, bit, the better we'll be and I'm, uh, I, I enjoy it. It's obviously to go into it too much but it's not been the best campaign overall for the team but we have kind of finished a bit stronger do you think the need to change things up in the middle helped yourself break into the team and get that opportunity um, well obviously I've, I've played the last few games now so it is, it's been good for me just to get a chance to get a run of games um, and I think like I said similarly like relationships building when the more you play it just the confidence breeds and uh, also a few good performances were, were uh, looking stronger and was a good feeling about the, about the boys How's your relationship with Gordon? What does he bring to you as a player? Emma, he's good. Uh, he's, al he's always on your case, isn't he? A, a thing to uh, to relax, so, which is good though, because it, it makes you, you know, you're always on it, and you're always um, giving it your all. How important is it for us to get a result at home in this last game? Um, well, I think it's always that the atmosphere at hand is always brilliant. You can never fault that. Um, I think we've had a couple of uh, not so good performances there, so I think we've just got to go in and confidence of the. You know, the la our last couple of performances and uh, look forward to it and try and get something in the game. Another kind of newer player in the squad is Akechianya, who came on in, in Sean in, in Macedonia. How has he settled into the squad? Yeah, he's a good lad. He's, uh, he's bright, you know, he's nice, no one knows, but he's quiet and doesn't say much. He's, uh, he's, he's a good lad and he, he, was, he was brilliant for us in Macedonia. Um, gave us something different, which we probably haven't had that pace out wide. Um, so he's good for us, he's a really good player for the squad. Came to Sean's goal. I think it was yourself that went charging through the middle of the park and managed to get that that free kick between yourself. So, do you like to get forward a bit more as a defender, or are you more comfortable staying in defence? Um, they are always tell me at Blackburn if I and if I intercept it just to step in, but I'm always a bit scared of losing it. It's make myself look silly, but uh, I know now and again. That's uh, not that often, like but now and again. Just lastly, what do you make of Croatia as a team? What are you looking at or expecting from them? Yeah, well, we know they're up there. They're, you know, they're one of the best around. Um, so it's going to be very difficult. Um, the quality of players are going, the, the level that they play. At, um, it's going to be difficult, but it was it was difficult out there as well. And we showed what, how we can uh, handle it. So I think we've just got to look forward to it and be confident.